So the Raspberry Pi 4 has been released and everyone out there is doing their YouTube videos on the specs, on how fast the data transfer rates are and so forth, and they look amazing, don't get me wrong. But I wanted to make a little bit of a different video, just for, you know, for the sake of it. But uh, one of the things that I came across was that, how do you tell from just looking at the boards, which model is which? So if you'd like to find out too, then stick around, because it's TechWiz time. Hey guys, Jonathan here with TechWiz Time, where I create technology tutorial and review videos. In this video, I'm going to be discussing how, or at least how I've found, to determine between the different models of Raspberry Pi 4. Now, at first glance, you're having a look at the top and you can't actually see anything really different about the different models. It, it, they all look the same, to be honest. Um, in particular, this one just has some writing on top of the Ethernet port. But these two here, um, yeah, they look the same. And it's like, well, okay, shouldn't it have the, on there somewhere that it's like, oh, this is the one gig model or this is the two gig model? You would think so, but I couldn't actually see anything. That is until I turned it upside down. So when you do turn it upside down, uh, up here near the USB 3 port and the Ethernet port, we've got there a 1.6 and 1019. Now, I know for a fact that this one here is the one gigabyte model. So 1019, 1.6, keep that in mind. Now, this one here is the two gigabyte model. And this one up the top says 2.4 and 1619. Okay, so different numbers up there. That, again, has been the only differentiating, dif differing factor that I can see between them so far. So then the four gigabyte model, up the top here we've got 3.3 .3 and 1919. So I thought we we're gonna to go to four, but yeah, we, um, we're at 3.3. .3. So again, that's the four gigabyte model and that's how I'm able to determine the difference between them in my instance. I don't know if those numbers are gonna change or be different on your boards. If you can have a look at yours and actually tell me down in the description, if your one gigabyte model has those numbers there, which again is 1.6 and then 1019. So if it's got those numbers on there, leave me a comment down below and just let me know, because I'd be interesting to find out if across the world, whether that's the same or not. Um, I haven't actually seen a video on this yet, so I'm sure there'll be more popping up after this one. But yeah, that's, that's how I've been able to determine the difference between the one gigabyte, the two gigabyte, and the four gigabyte models of Raspberry Pi 4. So hopefully that's gonna help you guys out there. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Also hit that bell icon to get notified whenever there's a new video out. Um, if you can, share this video on social media. It's something that can really help me out and it doesn't cost anything, it's free. It just takes a little bit of your time. So if you can share it on either Reddit, Facebook, or Twitter, or share it on all three if you can, that would be fantastic because it'd really help this channel to grow and to, yeah, get bigger and get out there to more people. So huge thanks in advance. But with that said, make sure you like this video, give it a big thumbs up, and I just really hope you enjoyed this video. All right, as always, imagine, learn, create.